in the Torah it's found, it says you have to, if you come across a bird's nest, you have to shoo away the mother before you take the eggs. It also says that you cannot, uh, you should, cannot slaughter an off, the offspring of a cow and the cow on the same day. And Rambam, um, who was a, one of the most important, I think, of the commentators, or the, or the Jewish legal scholars, says to us that the reason for this is because the capacity of a, of a mother animal to feel emotion toward its, toward its offspring is the same as, as, as in humans. In other words, he's saying it doesn't matter about a, a, an animal's intellect. The emotional capacity is not connected to intellect. So when a cow has its calf taken from her or slaughtered before her very eyes, she's going to have the same kind of emotional pain and reaction as a human would. And for me that's very important uh, because it's because now we've got a, a, a tremendous legal scholar who is fortifying the very beliefs that I have about the, about the pain that an animal is capable of suffering. So I don't need, I didn't need that source, but it's nice to be edified. As Rabbi Rosen said, there are pages and pages and pages of sources that support these ideas. And I'll tell you, there are very few pages that support the idea that we can disregard animals' pain. 